Hi guys, welcome to CA Final SCMP Self Paced Paper. I'm Anuj. We are doing MCQs of the first chapter that is introduction to SCMP. My aim of doing all these videos is basically one to help you all in clearing your SCMP. I'm going to be doing a shorter version of my course also or later on completely free for everybody on YouTube. So therefore that will help you to do the recap once your complete course is over. I do understand that this paper is not much important to you given in the new course that it does not have marks but then you still have to be clearing it before you will give your CA final exam. So ensure that you give adequate attention. I'm not saying too much attention but then the adequate attention so therefore you are clearing this paper. Let's start it off. Now uh, today's part that we all have is something called as value proposition map. Okay, now what is this all, uh, all about? If you're going to be doing a business, you are going to be having some product or some service. When will your business run or why the hell you have started the business? To serve some customer. So therefore the chart that you all see right now in front of you, there are two sections of that. One is customer profile. Customer profile means who is going to be your customer. What profile does he have? Is he say above 18, below 18? What kind of work does he do? What kind of interest does he have? Okay. So therefore, that is one part of this. The other is value proposition. What as a business you are coming to the customer for? That is the other part of this. Do remember, unless and until customer profile matches with a value proposition, it is impossible to do any business. If you are going to be a CA, you cannot try to offer your services to say some person who does not have taxable income or some person who is not interested in your services. So in this case, we always say that if you want to do a business, you should always be knowing who are going to be your customers. So therefore, first section that you need to address is customer profile. Then the other part is value proposition. Who are going to be your customers? What are their profile? Okay. And then what do you offer them? That is value proposition. Let's look into customer profile. There are three parts of customer profile. First, what jobs does customer do for which you are going to be offering a product or service? Second, when he does that job, what are the problems that he is facing? And what gains is he looking for by using any other product or service that will make his job easier? So there are three parts of that. Let's try to see each of them in a proper way. So first thing is customer profile. What do you mean by customer profile? Customer profile in this case describes important issues that business customers are trying to be resolving. Let's take one example, say of Baiju's. Okay. Now Baiju's in this case, Customer profile. Who are the customers? Who are the customers? Obviously, it is the students and more important, it is the parents also because ultimately they will be the decision maker. So therefore, this is a profile of the customer. Now try to think there are three parts of customer profile. One is part A. Let's call that thing as customer jobs. What do you mean by customer jobs? Describes the important issues that business customers are trying to be resolving. Try to be thinking who are your customers, sir, the parents and the students. Okay. What jobs they are trying to do? They are trying to make their kids study. That is whatever is their business aim. Now, one small thing. I understand that uh, Baiju's is in a very bad condition on the day that I'm making this video. I I know that they have a lot amount of money to be paid to like you know those people who have invested in them. I do understand since 2021 they have not filed their complete balance sheet also investors are too unhappy and I do understand from a value from a valuation of 22 billion it has fallen down to 3 billion and I do understand that it might become one of like you know the most flop shows ever in India okay especially in the tech center but then this is my example so let's continue. So, by Jews in this case, uh, <coughs> for them, customer jobs means what does a customer want to do? Okay. In our context, basically, the customer is trying to study. That is whatever is there. Okay. Now, so customer jobs are parent wants their children to study in fun and interactive way. Okay. Now, this fun way has come too far and due to that, actually, the kids don't study also. That is a different thing, but I'm not going to be getting emotional over here. So the next part, second, pains. Pains describes anything that annoys the customer before, during or after the job. Pains are basically the problems that a student or a parent is facing. In case of Baiju's, 
pains are obviously kids do not want to study kids are getting bored while studying now obviously baiju tries to be thinking we will address these issues later on to counter this you will have something called as pain relievers i will come to that in just a while but we are on the right hand side section whereby we are talking of customer profile so therefore pains that a customer faces is that the kids do not want to study they are bored okay further third gains gains are the outcome or the benefits that the customer expects or requires as well as the benefit which is complementary which is does not ex, uh, expect also but will be excited or surprised if he gets it so therefore basically by just think that what does a consumer want okay he wants to have some gains because of them purchasing by juice product so therefore this is the gain that a consumer wants so what gain do, do they want they want desired they want personalized learning that is one thing second real time monitoring tools that is whether they have understood they have not understood up and so on so every now and then if you will take the byju's products okay you will get a pop up of all the questions what is the answer to this so therefore you all can click so on and so forth okay so these are the gains that a consumer wants this is the right hand side of the entire value proposition map okay now on the left hand side now it is our turn it is our turn beta our turn in this case is we as a business how will we address those things how will we relieve the pains how will we give the gains to them that is whatever we are trying to be doing and how do we do that by offering our products and services so therefore come to the other part of this the other part is value proposition map describes the features of business value proposition which business has designed to address its customers through pains and gains okay and obviously by the jobs that we are going to be offering to them okay that is the products and the services so therefore now let's try to look at value proposition okay as a business you should always have value proposition to give you a small example small example why do you go to pizza hut what is value proposition of pizza hut to serve hot pizza to the customer the moment they come that is whatever is a value proposition and it should be tasty for them health is not one of their value proposition nobody eats pizza for a health here so your value proposition should always be very clear okay why the hell you are in existence what you will do for the customer that is whatever is the value proposition example for by juice in this case is for the students and parents looking for a superior educational experience by juice offers engaging video lessons by top educators personalized learning journeys and interactive practice now that is whatever by juice says also although it is a different case that you might have heard also like you know that they force the parents to take the loans also blah 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 again not getting emotional now first of part of that is nothing but products and services that you all offer what are the products and services that we all offer so basically this is bundle of all the things so therefore if you all see by juice offers lot amount of products for the consumers i'll read this whatever is there and then i'll show you which products like you know that by juice actually offer you might not be much uh, aware of that outlines a bundle of products and services that business is offering to its customer to help them to get a functional or emotional or personal job done and to address their pains and gains in the process of doing so so your products and services should relieve the pains that they are getting now and should be giving the gains that they are expecting so products and services you have by juice the learning app you have by juice early learn that is designed for the younger children classes from kg to 3 up and so on it focuses on like you know the basic skills like you know 5 plus 5 5 plus 6 up and so on then you have byju's classes now you have byju school also byju's exam prep also byju's parents connect app also through which the parents can connect with byju's okay the teachers up and so on so therefore they can learn their progress so therefore lot amount of products and services they all offer second is pain relievers explains how the products and services will alleviate specific customer pains before while and after the consumer trying to get the job done example one of the pains that we all saw before kids do not want to study and kids are getting bored so therefore how do we relieve them how do we relieve them of their pain as per byju's ease learning is a way ahead so therefore they get all the interactive videos you might have seen the founder 
Mr. Baiju, he will be coming showing like you know how the eye works up and so on. So all those kind of things. Although not many will be knowing that uh, Mr. Baiju got a call from IIMS many times, but then he rejected. He didn't want to study over there. Some people say he was actually the topper, but then he didn't want to go to IIMS. Although he was teaching CAT classes, and you might not believe that in South of India, uh, when he was teaching in the auditorium of 1200 students, 1200 is not a big number. That's all fine, but he was charging them 750 rupees per session. Okay, and there were so many people who were enrolling for it. That is whatever gave him the confidence to actually start by choose. In any case, so let's go further. So therefore, this is whatever Baiju aims, like, you know, that we will try to relieve this pain by making the interactive videos. The third part over here is green creators. Game creators is that the parents or the kids, they offer some gain, like, you know, that we come to know how the student is uh, performing, their uh, performance should improve up and so on. So therefore, gain creators describe how the products and the services create customer gains. Game creators show which of all the customer gains is addressed by value proposition and creating benefits and outcomes. So therefore, for Baiju, gain creators is now, what was a gain before that I had discussed? Gain was desire, personalized learning and real-time monitoring tools. And game creators, Baiju's apps exactly do that kind of a thing only. Baiju classes are interactive, they are personal. Apart from that, Baiju's uh, Parent Connect will help the parents to monitor the progress of the kid as such. Okay, further. Now, we always say that your business will be doing good if the customer profile exactly matches with the value proposition. We say it is a perfect fit. And if it is a perfect fit, then the business should be running. Sir, for Baiju's, wasn't it a perfect fit? This is not a case study on Baiju's. I am not trying to be doing that. Okay, my only aim is trying to explain you value proposition map. Okay, because our two MCQs are based on that funda. So, Mr. Anir Ban, C, uh, Chief Management Accountant and Advisor to CEO of Avanta Holdings. Considering the value proposition canvas, that is whatever we all did right now. Okay, this entire thing is called as value proposition canvas, which has two parts. One is value proposition that the business offers and the other thing is the customer profiles. Okay. Uh, considering the value proposition canvas as a tool to respond two aspects highlighted by customer profile analysis. You are a cost trainee who recently joined Avanta Holdings. Mr. Anir Ban asked you to appraise the following statement to pick up the correct statement regarding value proposition map. Okay. So value proposition map or value proposition canvas pick out the correct one out of these four. Bring the four options, please. A pain relievers and gain creators counter each other's effects. Okay, that is A. B. Pain relievers and gain creators are one and the same thing. C. Pain relievers are different from gain creators. Okay, D. Either one of the pain relievers or gain creators can be part of the value proposition map. Think of the correct answer. I have tried to be explaining to my best in this short while. So try to be thinking. Put your answer below. Chali. So I'll try to be answering. Out of A, B, C, D, which one is correct? A. I'm thinking pain relievers and green creators counter each other effects. They don't counter. They complement each other. Okay. Through pain relievers, we will try to relieve the pain that the customer is facing. Okay. Example, kids don't study. So therefore, we are trying to have like, you know, personalized learning for them. Okay. In through some interactive videos. Game creators are again those things that will help or it is basically that how my products give you the game that you are looking for. Sometimes both of them can be same also as such. Okay, that is one thing. But that is only sometimes, not always. So A, they don't counter each other's effects. Okay. B, pain relievers and gain creators are one and the same thing. Now, sometimes one feature of your product may relieve the pain and give the gain also. But they are not same as such. One is that relieves the pain. Kids are not studying. That is a pain. Okay. We relieve them by say interactive videos. 
game creators the parents want that they come to know about the progress so therefore there are parent there is parent connect app that is another feature that gives them that gain so sometimes it can be same also but it does not mean that they are always same so a is not the correct answer b is not the correct answer c pain relievers are different from gain creators that is whatever i am trying to be saying through a and b pain relievers and gain creators are different they can be same sometimes one feature might relieve the pain and give the gain also for a small example if you take say our lectures just an example don't take our lectures it is all together okay but just an example you will be relieving yourself from the pain of reading the modules plus in this case you will be getting the gain say extra knowledge so therefore one product gives you pain relief also and creates gain also but these are exceptional examples okay it might not be always d either one of the pain relievers or gain creators can be part of the value proposition no both of them can be in fact i just showed you so out of a b c and d c seems to be correct for me so i think so c is a correct answer c is a correct answer that was your first mcq now based upon this you have a second one in continuation to the previous mcq mr nilanjan is hired by avanta holdings as independent consultant for drafting of value proposition map again the same thing he suggests that <coughs> ranking of customer jobs pains gains is essential to respond mr anir ban is not convinced with the need of the ranks and he said that all the three elements of customer profile okay uh hence he seeks your help in evaluating following two statements regarding customer jobs pains and gains which are those two statements pains and gains are controlled by business all the pains need not be responded or addressed they are asking these two statements one is pains and gains are controlled by the business second all the pains and gains need not be responded or addressed okay get me the four options first one both the statements are correct okay b both the statements are incorrect c only statement one is correct second only statement two is correct now let's try to see both the statements will automatically answer although before that in case you would like to be commenting please comment below at this particular time okay so first pains and gains are controlled by the business boss they are not controlled by the business they are of the customer okay example kids do not want to study that is not because of the business even if business was not there kids do not want to be studying we are coming to relieve the customer of the pains that they are facing and give and trying to give the gains as such okay that is one thing so point number 1 is not correct they are not controlled by the business they are of the customer second all the pains and gains need not be responded or addressed see given a choice we would like to like you know address all the pains but we might not be because there might be lot of pains that a consumer is facing if you can try to say resolve most of those bigger bigger uh, pains and try to give the gains which impact the consumer a lot that will be more than enough as such example you want to go to eat pizza given a choice to you you want tasty pizza you want hot pizza and you want healthy pizza also abhi pizza hut cannot try to respond to all the things sir we want they want taste also they want health also everything is not possible so they don't take care of your health boss okay they take care of your taste bud so therefore they might not respond to all the pains and gains they will try to respond to whatever they can or most important things so point number 1 is definitely not correct point number 2 is definitely correct so therefore answer should be d over here only statement 2 is correct so that should be the correct one point number d is all correct okay now my job is done with this mcq i'll see you all next time i am taking extraordinary efforts to ensure that whatever you all are doing in my regular course i am trying to give you a complete recap of whatever you all have done and further in this case trying to do the mcqs in whatever interactive way i can so ensure that you spread this to your friends this is all free whatever is there on youtube you will find the playlist chapter wise so therefore you don't have to be searching much 
automatically once you start a particular playlist all the mcqs of that will be coming even the case study based mcqs are being done by us i'll see you all next time bye take care